Hey, welcome back, everybody. We got us a new toy, RV Works Cajun Fryer. We're about to get this thing rolling and uh, see how this thing works. Stay tuned. So this RV Works Fryer is a four gallon fryer. And what makes it special is the flue you look blue the fire comes through this flue and he's got a 45 degree angle so when you're frying all the crumbs and all the burnt stuff go to the bottom at the bottom underneath where the fryer comes through this oil down below stays at 120 degrees so you don't have all that burning of uh, all your crumbs and everything that comes out of it so when you fill it in your baskets sit here and we'll show you that here in a minute but the fire comes up, heat rises, so the oil above it's 350 degrees, the oil below it is 120 degrees. So what happens is you don't burn up oil. So you pay for the fryer by saving all your money on your oil. So we've got a big gauge, shows you where to start, where, where it finishes, frying temp 350, 375 degrees. It's on a cart. If you look in the back, back here, has a drain to drain the oil. And then this little wing nut, you can unscrew that, lift that top off, dump it out, whatever you need to do to clean it up. So it's very mobile and very easy to use. So we'll get some oil in it and then we'll start the frying process. Stay tuned. We're just using this five gallon pure clear frying oil. We got it from Sam's Club. It's only about $18 for a five gallon bucket. Seems to work real well. Getting close, we'll put the basket in there to make sure we get enough. Getting close. That oil is going to expand a little bit once we heat it. Right about right there is plenty. All right, we'll bring you back when we get ready to fire it up. So we got it lit, we'll see how it does. We'll see how long it takes to get this oil warmed up to 10. We're looking for about 350 and 375. We'll see how long it takes. About six minutes in, already to 225. So we're into the fry zone at about 12 minutes. We're going to take it up to 375. Then we're going to turn it off. Yeah, it does. So it's been about 13 and a half minutes. The fryer's up to 375 degrees. We're gonna turn down the propane and see how long it lasts at 375. And then we're gonna pop some frozen stuff in there and just see how the temperature regulates. We'll be right back with you. Propane is totally off. It's holding about, it's about 390 right now. Uh, we'll see about how long it lasts been about seven minutes as you can see the temperature keeps it's kept rising a little bit we'll open this top up to let it come down a little bit but we wanted to kind of see how long it'll keep a temperature so we'll check it out in the state of Texas we call these turd floaters makes it tough to cook but we'll power through it tips holding real good in the fryer and uh, we'll be back when we get over to the house to be able to grab something cold to throw in there and fry it up See y'all in a minute. Hey y'all, it's been about 32 minutes since we got it up to the high max on the on the uh, fryer. 
and it looks like it's holding pretty good. It's down to about 300 and probably 35 degrees. And uh, we're gonna crank this thing back up a little bit, just kind of trying to show you a little bit of how long it'll last. Uh, we'll get it cranked back up and then we'll add something cold to it and see how the temperature regulates. Now remember, this doesn't regulate by itself. You have to regulate it with the regulator in the back. So you get it up to frying temperature, lower it down, and then when you get down to about this range, you can crank it back up again. We'll crank it back up and get something frying in here. See you on in a minute. All right, guys, we got it kicked on. We're gonna take it to 375. We're gonna drop some corn dogs in there and see how it does. This thing holds temperature really, really well, so I don't think there would be much of a blip. There's four gallons of, of grease there, so there's a lot to absorb any kind of cold meat or french fries or corn dogs or whatever it is you got. But we're gonna cook three corn dogs, see how it goes, and give you a kind of a synopsis at the end. See you soon. Temperature didn't even drop down. It's, it's holding real steady. Uh, it's not a whole lot of cold stuff, but it is some cold stuff. So we'll do these for about nine minutes and then we'll eat them up. So the consensus is so far so good on this beast. We're gonna cook up some stuff in the next couple of days and uh, we'll show you how it turns out. Come back and see us.